Mar. I was born in Detroit and I was raised in East Point. I am 31 years old. I am a Muslima. I do follow the Islam religion. So when I was studying in the Quran and just reading um, in hadiths and just just reading about like everything and it came about where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala like he created human, he created angel, he created jinn. And that's how I came about it. When I was four, um, there, my parents still live there. It's a bungalow in East Point. That's where I grew up. Um, there is a closet addict um, filled with cedar wood, so that smell I will never forget. I used to go into the closet and play with something. <laughs> I really don't know what it is at that point. I thought it was maybe a ghost, a spirit, or whatnot. What my mom would tell me and what my sister would tell me is that they would hear different voices, two different voices. Another, my voice, a little kid, and an older, uh, an older lady's voice. And I just remember gray, like smoky gray light. Um, and um, come to find out, I heard that gins are made out of smokeless flame. Um, but it's just, uh, one day I like ran downstairs and uh, I was just crying. I was crying to my mom. I still remember how I felt like, like, like she wouldn't let me play with her anymore. I was just hysterical. I don't know what. I just remember like a, something scary, like scary face. I ran downstairs and that was it. That was the last time like I played with this girl. Like, I don't know what it was, but it was, um, it was weird. I don't know. It's, it seems really crazy, you know, but um, I just remember being really scared. But um, when I started going to school, my parents could hear something upstairs. They would tell me they'd go upstairs and they would see a girl that looked just like me. And in, in my culture, um, they were saying um, in Khmer, um, they called these entities like Mea um, Patea, mean master of the house. They were already there. That's, that's their home. That's their home. And they'd live there. And it's two of them, the younger girl and the older lady. And I guess they're still there. I just remember Gray. I remember a scary face, a gray face. I don't, but I don't remember what it looked like. I feel the entity um, that I was playing with was very friendly and she wanted to be my friend. You know, I feel like um, I could um, share her, my secrets at that time or, or whatnot, like she was my best friend. Um, and I felt like she felt the same way. I remember the fear. I remember being really sad when I couldn't play with her anymore. Sometimes I feel the sadness when I go there to my parents' house, like that she's sad that I'm not there. I remember sitting down with it, um, but like I said, I don't remember what she looked like or what it looked like, um, but I felt safe. I am totally looking forward to watch this movie, Jen. I've been waiting for so long, ever since I saw that poster. Fire breather? Oh, I can't wait. Like, ah, uh, yes.